the Bramley Moor Dock Stadium is intended to be Everton's new home after a 125-year stay at Goodison Park. The new development for the Toffees is certainly beneficial for the Toffees and their fans, who view their current stadium as old and decrepit. However, their plans have been met with firm opposition. Here are seven facts on the proposed Bramley Moor Dock Stadium. Number 1. Cost Everton were approved to build Bramley Moor Dock in 2016 and received backing from the Liverpool City Council to act as guarantors for the £300 million plus loans required. Everton also enlisted financial brokers JP Morgan and MUFG to help secure the money for the construction. Number 2. Capacity Bramley Moor Dock Stadium should be able to hold 52,888 spectators. This is an upgrade to Goodison Park's 39,414 capacity. Number 3. Exterior Everton's proposed new stadium is a bowl designed and constructed of steel and glass, with the current dock being filled with reclaimed sand from the River Mersey. Number 4. Construction Planning permission was submitted around the end of 2019. Once granted, construction work can begin. The club hopes to be able to start playing at the ground from the 2023-24 season. Number 5. Distance The new stadium is set roughly two miles away from where Goodison Park currently is. Liverpool is famous for having their two stadiums being a very short distance apart, just 1.2 miles in fact. However, the new stadium will disrupt this fact. Number 6. Similarities with other stadiums Similar to Tottenham's new stadium, it will have a single-tier cop stand. Designs are inspired by the Dockland and warehouse buildings around the stadium. Number 7. UNESCO title loss Officials at UNESCO warned that the development of Bramley Moor Stadium would lead to a loss of Liverpool City of World Heritage status. It may not be possible for Liverpool to support its development ambitions and hold on to its UNESCO status, and that the stadium plans were unlikely to help. Many high figures in Liverpool's local government also stood in opposition of the development of the stadium.